all its tiles and it's still growing which is excellent maybe I could actually focus production and see how it, uh, it, it's not it's not a big deal and I don't need another engineer so I don't need great people this guy is also growing still and I'm, I'll let him grow to pop 15 and then switch to what's this oh no we're going to work the tile. There we go. And what do we mess up now? Probably this city. Yep. There we go. Another great general, which we will pull down here. Because these guys here are going to prepare for attacking these cities here. If need be. And you can do absolutely nothing I guess you could trade post those tiles down there uh -huh. okay you can wait here and now let's go back to the front now that we sorted that those things up out. If I can't liberate Cathy, I'll just raise Abydos and Corihuaya. I need fin uh, financially solid cities, which have a lot of trade posts, not some Tundra, you know, with one gold mine. That's it. Let's proceed to the next turn. Modern Warfare um, relies a lot on different resources. Some people on Syphantic forums think that oil is not important, but I disagree. It's very important, especially if you don't have aluminum, and even then, because you won't have enough aluminum to upgrade all your units. Uh, so what you really need to do is you need to decide uh, what types of units you need more and use aluminum for those units and still the bulk of, you, uh, of your units will probably be consisting of oil based ones for example battleships the only three range naval vessel in the game and one of the most powerful ones to have although it's slow uses oil um, bombers also use oil and they and are quite decent until you can get a hold on to stealth bombers and stealth bombers cannot be uh, p uh, placed on, on carriers so since the last patch so they use oil as well carrier use uh, carriers use oil so oil is very important uh, even more so in the age before aluminum type units so keep that in mind um, you will promote of this unit finally and let's proceed with the bombardment of this city I cannot take it yet but I don't really need to I'm not in a hurry I'm still happiness positive and that's all that matters for now Pachachuti is going down there is no doubt about that. And we can finally start thinking about how to deal with either Japan or Egypt. They are currently at war. Uh, no, they are not at war. Okay. Then I guess Egypt is going to be my next target. Oh yes, they signed a peace treaty, that's right. Oh, huh. Okay. Now they are at war. Ouch. I got a unit killed. 
that's... Oh. And that was a really nice unit. Bastards. Uh, I'll make sure that they pay for that and I actually... That means that I need a few more mech infantries as well. I don't have that many mech infantry and those units should be the bulk of your army. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I should have around ten at least. And we can finally start bombarding St. Petersburg. And with these bombers as well, I'm going to wait with... Oh, great. That was fast. And, and and I can liberate St. Petersburg, which means I can probably liberate another city of Catherine's um, and simply gift her away the cities I don't want or don't need. And this was a really ugly thing that happened here. that unit dying. They'll, I'll make sure they pay for that. There. Die. Die, die, die. And you can proceed here. do you want? You can go... you can stay here actually. That's right. And... I need to move these guys down as well. Okay, I hope this city falls next turn. St. Petersburg fell. And we are still happiness positive. And we can move this fighter down here to St. Petersburg to gain some line of sight. Fighters give a six uh, tile radius line of sight. Which also makes them important why you should build them. Uh, well, except for, you know, the intercept part. Look at this, Japan is spamming cities all over the globe. I hate him. I really do. Whoa. How is he damaging my units so badly? I don't know. But I need to take out this city now. Ramsey's stuff ended and that did a little hit on my happiness. Let's see if we can trade with Oda maybe. He didn't denounce me as you can see because he is not scripted to hate warmongers. And that's a part of the um, AI diplomacy script. I need to take these guys back to heal. To Abydos, for example. And now it's time to finally finish off this city because it's starting to get on my nerves, really. And the city with the unpronounceable name, it falls. There we go. All units acted. Um, what to do with you? There. And start on this mine immediately. Heal up. 
you fortify the bomber and I will need I don't know what do I need paratroopers or mechanized infantry always a good bet more mechinf or maybe even more fighters yes more fighters heal up it's time to start killing off humanaga and I'll probably gift that city to Catherine because it's all farms and no trade posts there does does he have more aluminum? No he doesn't, he has some crappy oil down there but I don't care I'll just take Moscow and yeah maybe even won't resurrect Catherine I could probably kill off Pachachuti completely and leave him with one city here yep probably that's what I'm going to do and he is going to pay for killing one of my units there we go this city is also ready to fall and this artillery has healed up next turn Ramses asks for a research agreement no sorry I am not going to fall for that one Wait, he, he likes me now? No, he hates me. Losing grasp of Ryu, time to invest money. Uh, one of my friendly city states, and I have no uranium discovered within my borders. Wow. Let's see where we can find uranium. Well, we have some from a city state, but still. Itza. That means we need Itza. Simple as. Which means this bomber will go down. Can it bombard Itza? No. It's going to go down to Persepolis and I'm going to take Itza for the uranium. And that's it. Bombard, bombard, bombard. This is a tough nut to crack. Where is my artillery piece? There we go. And even more promotions. There we go. Bombard Moscow. And I can probably take Moscow now if I attack with this rocket artillery. Yes. No annex. No. Idiot. Idiot with a capital I. Oh, come on. That was a very bad misclick on my part. That happened because I am used to where the uh, puppet button is and I had the option to liberate Moscow and that's what happened so I'll guess I'll have to live with Moscow as an annexed city unfortunately and it's time to finish off the Incas Heal up there. Move the artillery to a safe position. Heal up as well. 
I hate it when that happens. I really hate it. There we go. Artillery. More attacks. And these are healing up. Maybe I'll actually take Novgorod and gift back. I don't know. No, I won't. I won't gift back Moscow to Kathy. That would be a terrible idea. And move this fighter down for more sight. Can I take this city now? Yes. Raise the city. Raise it to the ground and nuclear fission or stealth bombers. Stealth. There we go. Enemy is near, you mean a worker. That's not an enemy. That's a potential friend. And yes, yeah, sure, Kathy, you can have Humanaga. Why not? Soon. Soon. Puppet. Fortify here. We are still okay with money. Which is very good news. And that's, I think, it considering his armies. He has no more. Which means we can start to move these slow moving units back to the north. Some more subs. And now I'll need a battleship here. Nothing of importance. Okay. Great general. Heal there, heal. Rebase, I guess. Fortify. Let's move out this unit, see what we can do here. I guess it's time to bombard. turn. Aluminum in one turn. Excellent. And after I take, take Novgorod I'm going to end this phase and continue with Probably attacking either Egypt or Japan. Maybe even Japan first. More promotions. Um, stealth bombers for some reason cannot earn promotions so if, uh, if you want to use them it's better to First build them up as regular bombers and then upgrade them to stealth because then they keep their promos. 
Maybe I can take that city now. Yep. And liberate. Finally. Hello, Kathy. Let's see how the victory progress is now. Showing... Uh, yes, she lost her capital, but now I can trade her some of the cities I captured. And I'm going to take peace with Pechachuti now. If he will take it. Yes, he will. Will he give me something more? Nope. Okay. Peace treaty it is. And I can gift Kathy Abydos. I really don't need it. Trade cities. Abydos. And you have 170 gold. Oh, you won't give me anything. Okay. Emotionless. Wow. That's something I never saw before in this game. Maybe it will change next turn. I don't know. Or maybe she's like, you know, pretending to be a robot because we liberated her and now she has to vote for us in the UN. And you can also have Human Eye Kathy. So... Here, have it. I must accept, and that is exactly right, you must. And, okay. That concludes this part of the game. See you in the next one.